The BBC has had a vendetta against Florence Nightingale for many years. They've got two feature films out which denounce her in various ways. I don't say wholly, they also have some good points in, but uh, actually make some quite fraudulent points. And they have, uh, uh, they've broadcast uh, The Real Angel of the Crimean War, which is on Mary Seacole, and which says that Nightingale discriminated against her, which isn't true. There's also something called Horrible Histories. Now, Horrible Histories, these are short little vignettes, and they're supposed to be amusing, but there's nothing funny about calling someone a racist, especially if they're not. The nursing call was for British girls. You're from Jamaica. And the BBC's Horrible Histories actually has a segment, and these are using actresses. Uh, a white Florence Nightingale in a nurse's uniform elbowing aside a black Mary Seacole in a nurse's uniform. Mary Seacole wasn't black. She was three-quarters white. She never wore a nurse's uniform because she wasn't a nurse. She dressed as a restaurant proprietress. No modest white cap on her head. She had a flamboyant hat with ribbons. She was a prosperous restaurant proprietress, and that's how she dressed. There was never such a scene as that. This is BBC fiction, and it accuses Nightingale of being a racist. It presents her as a racist, and this is simply untrue, and yet this is a vignette that is shown to school children, and it's available on a YouTube. The BBC has been intransigent on this subject. Uh, they are pro-Mary sequel, and They've put out all of this uh, uh, mythical material, and they're, they haven't taken it down. Complaints have gone in, and they either lose them or they deny them. Uh, it's perfectly clear on the YouTube. You see a white Florence Nightingale elbowing aside a black actress purporting to look like a nurse. I mean, this fraudulent presentation, they've been asked to take it down and to issue an apology and to get the story right.